Today we are seeing how far we can trade the Nike Panda Dunks. This is probably one of the most popular sneakers in the world right now. We wanted to start the challenge off right by buying this sneaker at retail, which cost $100. So finished on how to restock a few days ago and we were able to secure a pair for retail. All right, so I just joined a queue for JD Sports. It should be in one minute when things start going. Hopefully I get something there. And we're also trying to get on finish line and I cannot find where to go. Just found the Pandas on finish line and I'm trying to get through. Found it, found it, $110, men's, go for men's eight and a half, had the bag. All right, here we go, see if I can place the order. Check out finish line, that would be easy. Got them, eight and a half, not that bad. That was my first time going for Pandas for retail and it was pretty easy to be honest. Right now it's 10.01, they dropped the 10. Let's go, there's our trade shoe. So our cost basis is $100 with these sneakers. As far as store credit goes, we're looking at about 200 to 250 bucks. We're gonna be going to about five different sneaker stores today and seeing how far we can trade up this sneaker. And whatever sneaker we end up with, at the end of the day, we're gonna give away to you guys for free on this video. Let's go ahead and head to the first store and trade these Panda Ducks. Let's go. All right, just got to the first store. We are headed to Showroom ATL. Try to get this first trade going for the Pandas. See what credit we can get. Size eight and a half. Let's go. All right, just got to the showroom. We brought them some Pandas. So you're the first of this trade series. We're basically trying to trade those up and see how far we can go today. I know this is probably a popular shoe for most stores. So it should be an easy sell. Want to see what store credit we could get and then uh, kind of go from there. Again, 250. 250 store credit. 250 store credit is good for me. So we'll do that and then uh, we'll look around. Maybe if you have some options that you think would be good and then uh, kind of go from there. All right, three options. So we're looking at what are these easy 450s? Black. Utility black. Utility black. Okay. And some dunk lows. Clark and Clarks. Okay. And then green. Then green. Cool. I guess we'll kind of, you're cool with any of those options. Yeah. So we'll, uh, I'll kind of talk with Nick, kind of figure out what we think will be best for the trade challenge and then kind of go from there. Good. So let's see. All right. So here are the three options that we have so far. Initially, so like some of these they have a little higher, 280, 260, 250. Market on these I know is like 250 ish, which can be good because that'll give us like, I think at stores it'll be like 300. Um, these I feel like it'd be harder for the trade because they're a little older. Do you think so, Nick? Yeah, I think, I mean, the Yeezy's weird. I don't think people are really selling too many of those yeah. right now. And that Jordan one's a little old for me. Yeah, I think people aren't wearing ones as much. I think the dunks are like it right now. And uh, so, I mean, this is Atlanta also, so Clark University. I, I, mean, I think that's an easy option. I think that's a good trade. So let's go see if they're ready to lock this in. We decided right. Clark Atlanta's for the Pandas. You cool with that? Right. Ready to lock it in, start the trade series off? Got it. Appreciate it. So here we go, guys. First trade up, dunk for dunk. Probably gonna see a lot of the dunks today. So we'll see how far we can go. All right, first trade complete. We went from $100 in to now having a pair of Clark Atlantas at a size nine that right now before fees on StockX are $237. So after fees, we're looking at about $260-ish. So we went from 100 to 260. And let's see what we can take this for. Hopefully we can get around 260 to 300 trade credit. And usually with that, we're able to wiggle a little bit and add some more in. So uh, we're gonna head now to probably Good Times Atlanta. We're going into the city. Let's go. All right guys, just got over to Good Times Atlanta area. We're gonna go over there now. We might do a challenge with them and see if we do rock, paper, scissors. And if they win, then we buy a shoe that we lose money on, we're down 20 bucks. And if we win, we get a shoe that's worth an extra $20 in credit. We're gonna see if that'll work, but uh, I don't know yet, but let's head to Good Times Atlanta. All right, so this is where we're at. We start with the pandas that I got for retail. And we're here, you know what these are? Ah, yes, Clark Dunks. it's not too bad. But since you guys like to have fun with these, we want to have a little bit of a challenge with this. 
How about we pick two shoes, one that's worth less, one that's worth a little bit more, mm -hmm. and then we rock, paper, scissors, whoever wins. If I win, I get the more expensive shoe. If you win, I have to take the less expensive shoe. Yeah, I'm down. You're down? Yeah, Holy? for sure. All right, let's find two options. Yeah, see what we can do. Let's figure on that. So he said up to like three, 350-ish. So we have to find that range. All right, here's a 280 right here. So this is the championship dunk. So this maybe could, could be good as like the lower. And then, because it's kind of like a panda. And then we could find a hot. Why this is risky? Because this could reset us. This can take us a step back. And we don't want that. We're trying to go up. So I gotta get my, what do I go for, Nick? I, don't know. I need your skills. Are scissors? Uh, oh. I don't know, paper might be the move. Paper might be the move. It's a prank. Imagine, <laughs> imagine rock, paper, scissors for CPFMs. <laughs> My phone running stuff. Okay, that's good. Yeah, yeah. So I think these two would be good, and then we do it like that. Yeah, that's straight. I'm done so, on that. All right, we got our two options: the eBay deconstructed or the uh, the Jordan Three Canyon Purples. You ready to rock, paper, scissors? Yeah. This is the lower one. This is the higher one. If I win. I'm leaving with these. If you win, I'm leaving with these. Yeah, I'm down. Are we doing two out of three? Yeah. Okay. Because everybody, I'm doing rock. Paper, scissors. Then you throw it, yeah. Okay. All right, cool. Let me know when you're ready. All right, ready? Rock, paper, shoot. Ooh. Ooh. First one. Oh, man. It's not good. Oh, oh man. Come on. man. Yeah. We just got reset, just like that. Dang. I don't be losing this, man. I took Nick's advice. He told me paper. <laughs> Dang. All right. The house always wins. The house wins. I'll grab you for you. We just got set back. All right, well, I don't know if that was a great idea. I just took a step down. Probably like 170 on resale apps. I just took a $70 hit off of freaking rock, paper, scissors, and I didn't even think about it. I didn't even like, I should've put more thought into it, but. Sorry about the bad suggestions. Yeah, well, hopefully we can trade up in the next spot. I got, do I double down and go for another rock, paper, scissors and try to get my money back? Like and you're at a casino, or do I? I really I... do think you might need to try and get the money back. <laughs> We'll see, we're gonna head to this spot. This is actually Khan. He used to work in another store in Atlanta. He's in a new spot. We're gonna head to him now and then uh, try to keep trading up. All right, we're at a static ATL right now. We're gonna do our trade and try to redeem ourselves. And keep going up. So we started with a pair of pandas that I got for retail. We did another trade up, and then at the last place, we did rock, paper, scissors for a cheaper shoe and a more expensive shoe, and I lost the rock, paper, scissors. So it set us back, but we're just trying to trade today, see how far we can trade from the pandas. This is what we have right now. So kind of see what you put them at store credit. Sure, this is size nine. For these, uh, I've got 200 credit. 200 credit, okay. So let's see if we can look around, find something, 200 credit, and then uh, go from there. Not a dub, but I don't think it has come out yet. It's still called a panda, but oh, okay. with the red, it's a good one. All right, so I think we might have found a pair. We're looking at the Drake Air Force Ones as a good one. I think this could be a good one. These are, these are pretty hot right now. I think it'd be a nice trade. And I think the next store we're going to would like these. So I think this might be the option. Waiting on Con right now. He's gonna grab the box. I think we can lock that in. All right, Con, ready to lock in. You got the eBay's for the Nocta Air Force Ones. Let's do it. All right, lock it in. There we go. Nice trade. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. And uh, we'll hopefully can keep moving on up from here. So the eBay's definitely set us back in our trading up, but right now I think we're in a good spot right now with the uh, Drake Air Force Ones. I think these are a pretty sought after pair right now. Can't go wrong with the Air Force Ones. So we're gonna head now, good times maybe, or versus. We got two more stores to trade up and get you guys a pair for good boy. All right guys, we're over at Full Circle Atlanta right now. We're gonna go ahead and do this trade. This is trade number four. Hopefully we can get another good trade from this. Maybe we'll bring back the rock, paper, scissors. And try again. All 
right, we're doing a little trade up challenge. We started with Panda Dunks, we made our way up pretty high. Then we did a challenge of rock, paper, scissors with the store. If we won, we got to get a higher price shoe, we lost to get a lower, we lost. So we got set back. So this is after our setback, we're now at Nocta Drake Air Force Ones. And so we're just trying to do a little trade, trade for whatever. I don't know if you'd be interested in doing the rock, paper, scissors because I'm kind of nervous to do it again <laughs> because I don't want to go even further down. Um, but the ultimate goal, we're giving away the shoe that we end up with. So it's all for the viewers. So whatever you guys think, maybe check store credit, what you think they're, they're worth, and then um, go from there. Maybe go a little higher. We, we'll do 250 for you. 250? Um, okay. Um, we can do rock, paper, scissors if you want, but I totally, I almost <laughs> don't want to offer it because I want to help you get the most out of them as possible. So it's up to you. What I'll if leave we the did, ball in your court here? What if we did 250 and the rock, paper, scissors, if I beat you, then I can get 300 store credit? Let's do it. So I there's no less chance of me for losing. Yeah, coach. for the video. All right, we'll so should it. we do it after or should we find a shoe first? Do you want to find a shoe? Yeah, let's find a shoe and right. see if we can do it. Let's we'll try that. to minimize our risk here. So I'm, yeah. not trying to, no, I'm not trying to get you guys a bad shoe. Yeah. It's so annoying because we're literally Pandas are like 250 now. <laughs> like, I should not have freaking done that rock scissors. I would have. Dang, man. So this is the 300. Okay. These are at 250. So All right. Man, man, man. Who you get? Who's stepping up to the plate? I was about to say, are you how are you feeling with your game of rock paper scissors? I think you got this one. All right. Are you ready? One out of one, one or two out of three? Two out of three. All right. On the line. Ready. Right. Oh, man. man, I cannot lose again. All right. Okay, well, let me get my God. <laughs> I'm a few worse. You know what we're gonna do though? To contribute to the video, we're gonna do the three. We can't let Thank you go. You. We can't let you go I appreciate two that. back to back. So we'll we'll do that one for you. I'm the worst rock paper scissors player in Atlanta currently. I'm two, <laughs> 0 for two right now. I appreciate that. But uh, I'm trying to trying to make my way back up. Thank yeah. you for that. Anything we can help with. There's the trade right there. All right, so we got this pair of Jordan 3s here and uh, shout out to Full Circle for doing that. I don't know, my game is off for the rock, paper, scissors. I don't like it. I should, by now if I was winning, I would probably, we'd probably be at like a $600 shoot. But we got one more store left. This is gonna be our final store of the day versus ATL, hopefully they like these, and hopefully they can get a good uh, little trade up and end this off right. So, we're gonna head there now, and finish off these trades. All right, we are at the last stop versus Atlanta. Let's hope we can get a good final trade, and I might be adding something on there personally from me to make this better, because I was the one that handed the L's to you guys. So, we'll see what we do at the end of this, but let's go try to get this last trade in. All right, so we're on a pair of shoes. We're doing a little trade challenge today. This is actually the final store. Whatever we trade these for, we're gonna be giving away. So we're trying to do a little bit of a trade up. All right, here, hopefully it's a good one for you guys. Three, size 11. So decent pair, but trying to mainly just trade and see what uh, see what we can find. Get some store credit, I guess, and then see what uh, see what you guys got. Yeah, just you can look those up. Let us know whatever store credit you might think they're worth, and then we can find some. Think, what do we think? Um, for this pair, we could do like 250 store credit. 250 store credit. All right. We'll look around real quick, see if there's anything that we can find, and then uh, kind of go from there. Okay, cool. Cool. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna end up adding some cash on top on our end to make it better because I took the L's with the rock, paper, scissors. So we're gonna put up two shoes right now on Instagram and bet you guys vote which one it is, and that's the one we're gonna go for. So I'm gonna put this up now. So it's, this is pretty, pretty preliminary, but right now we're at 65.35. So. Seems pretty obvious. I don't think that's gonna change too much. So that's only, not too many votes, but I think that's the way. All right, so we're gonna do these, but we're gonna add cash on top. Throughout the video, I took some L's, and so I'm trying to give them back something good. So whatever cash on top, that would be just let us know.
All right, so there's the final pair. We're gonna actually go back to the warehouse and have you guys give you all the details on how to enter this giveaway. But uh, we ended with a good pair there. Had to do it for you guys because I took the L's. So let's head back to the warehouse and show you guys the giveaway details. All right, guys, rules this giveaway are very simple and up on the screen. Number one, you have to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Number two, you have to follow at Harrison Neville on Instagram. Number three, comment on this video your Instagram username and your favorite shoe that we traded in this video. And we will go ahead and pick the winner in two weeks time and good luck.